Why yes, I did record the entire video and then decide it wasn't framed correctly. So yes, I am recording it again. No, I'm not pleased about it. <sighs> Hello again, internet. Alright, so I'm going to a concert tonight and I figured, hey, that's a good theme, let's talk about concerts. But then I decided that was an awful theme, so instead I'm going to, to talk to you about Canadian music. Or at least, some of the Canadian musicians I listen to. It'll be fun! Yay! The concert I'm going to tonight is the band Stars, seen here. I first started listening to Stars in junior high. I would walk to school in grade 9 listening to Look Up, which is a song from the album Heart. Then they came out with this song, Set Yourself on Fire, which I pretty much memorized during Art 30. Albert has weird numbering systems, don't worry about it. You might have seen in my first video that big drawing behind me on my bed wall. That one I did in Art 30, listening to this album. Good album. Sarah Sleen. She is adorable. Oh my god, I love her. <laughs> she has some older music that I've loved forever. Songs like California from day one. John the 23rd and Last Year's War are the ones that come to mind. They are so pretty and I totally recommend them. Her most recent album is Land and Sea. It's actually a double album. Land is a very poppy album. It was produced by Joel Plaskett who is also East Coast and he is super fun to listen to on his own. If you've ever heard the album Three, good. If you haven't, go listen to it. Sia is a lot more like her older stuff in that it's a lot of piano work, a lot of strings, and it's so pretty. So if you wanted kind of a spectrum of her music, this one's actually a really good one to go with because it has pop and more classical influence stuff too. The Weaker Thans. They have several albums and I really like all of them. My favorite one is probably Left and Leaving. This album is actually a combination of a few of their older albums. Uh, it has songs from a bunch of them, including Virtute the Cat Explains Her Departure, which is pretty much the most heartbreaking song a cat lover can hear because it's about a cat who runs away and gets lost and can't find her way back, and it breaks my heart every time. It's super sad. Why did you abandon me? We then start to get into some Alberta bands such as Tegan and Sarah, who you've probably heard on the radio because their most recent album, Closer, has a couple of singles already, I think. My favorite song on this album is Now I'm All Messed Up. There's a back and forth at the end of the song where Sarah says go, but Tegan's saying please stay, and every time I hear it, I just break. Ah! Oh. If you wanted to listen to some Alberta music, they're a really good choice to go with. Hooray! A much less well-known musician from Edmonton slash Alberta is Christian Hansen. I say he's from Alberta, but that's not true. I'm pretty sure he's from BC and he just lived in Edmonton for a while. But yeah, he did a solo album called The Super Awkward Album, which has one of my favorite songs ever. It's called Cinnamon Hearts and I'm sure I will someday play a cover here on YouTube with my ukulele. Or at least I'll record it and then possibly never post it because that's how I do. Our final stop in the East to West trip through my CD collection in Canada, we get to Hey Ocean from Vancouver. I really love this band, I've only been listening to them for about a year and a half, but they are so good. So good. They started out kind of funky, uh, very coast influence, but their most recent album is, is a little more poppy. You might recognize Hey Ocean as being the band whose female vocalist is one of the voices on My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. Ashley Ball is the voice of Applejack and Rainbow Dash, so if you've ever seen that show or if you're a brony, uh, you should probably check out Hey Ocean. Obviously there's more than 10 Canadian bands who are worth checking out. This is just the ones I found in five minutes of going through my CD collection. Yes I know, CD collections are old school. It's better than a mixtape. I'll try to make a list of these bands at least and put them in the description doobly-doo thing that is below me right now. Let me know if you check any of these bands out. I would love to hear some opinions from you guys or any recommendations. Always love recommendations for music, so let me know. And of course, feel free to like and subscribe to this channel and I will try to keep posting videos every Sunday or Monday if I s fall asleep again. Sorry guys. Okay, bye, internet. Bye.